submit. Your reckless actions endanger the world. know about Salazar Slytherin and the Dark Arts, the best prepared we'll be. If either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the Headmaster immediately. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. The Dark Arts seem harmless until it's too late. None of us will be able to avoid dark magic forever. What do we do now? It's up to us. I can teach you Crucio, or I can cast it on you. I'm, I'm ready. ready. Crucio! You've made your choice. Two of you done! Stand the fuck back. It's hammer time. This way for the happy ending. Jimmy.
humanity's survival depends on the red gold pumping through my veins. Well, sounds like you're the star of the show now. This motherfucker! Jim Gordon never gave up on anything. That's why Gotham City is still here. It's why I'm still here. And I've known for a while now that someday, like him, I'd have to work with you. I've seen plenty of criminals in my career, but nothing could have prepared me for this. Well, well, if it isn't Brat Girl. Gotham City is at her weakest. There's blood in the water. 
and the sharks are circling. They're all making their move. Play nice. But we aren't going to give up. A storm has risen over Gotham. Nothing can stop it! <laughs> See you at the premiere. I need your help. Your skills. Your knowledge. Your adaptability. You got my back? Biopic is based on a true story. My story. Soon, the world will feel the cold as I do. I got one last little surprise for you. Come to watch the show, Red Hood. Nah, I'm just here to kick your ass. <laughs> Pre-order now. Hello, friends. It's your old pal, Stan, coming to you through the magic of marketing to let you know that your search for quality entertainment is about to bear fruit. But I wouldn't be doing my job if I just dropped the details on you without a little buildup. I want you to see the kind of fine dining establishments you'll be visiting, like this one. Get lost. And if escapism is your cup of flavor, you can't do much better than this exotic and extremely remote island. Stay back! How did you find me? Return to Monkey Island launches September 19th, which happens to be International Talk Like a Pirate Day. But you don't have to wait. You can order it right now, before it's even out. Something we in the marketing industry call a pre-order. As a bonus, I'm ready to unload this shipment of beautiful horse armor to anyone who pre-orders Return to Monkey Island. It'll look fantastic in your inventory. Oi, you missed a spot. I've got to go now. I've got a lot of irons and a lot of fires. You know how it is. But I'll be back to steal every scene I'm in in Return to Monkey Island. I'll see you there. All pre-order customers will receive the exclusive horse armor item in their inventory. Please note that the horse armor has no practical use in-game and in no way will contribute to the gameplay, puzzles, or narrative of Return to Monkey Island. The sand has memories. Memories of our past. When gods walked this world and our heroes stood amongst them. But the gods' vanity grew, and in their struggle, we were cast away. Only remnants of these stories remain, in the sand, in the ruins of this shattered, broken world.
Even in ruins, we endure. We won't let go. For now, we can stand for ourselves. And face... Gods. and join the deadliest spectacle of this season. I'm gonna tell you a story about a species that survived millennia. Homo neanderthalensis, Homo rhodesiensis, Homo erectus, all of them wiped out by the deadliest species of all, us. I am Astrid. This is the new arena, and my advice for you, stay alive. Every day you fight for survival. But today, you fight for glory. Anyone can be a warrior. What makes you different is the spirit of a champion. Let out the pain. Most stories in the Borderlands start bloody. They end bloody, too. Sometimes, all it takes to change the galaxy is a trio of losers trying to get through a bad day. We are in the middle of a TDR invasion. Leave immediately! This area is now under TDR jurisdiction! They think there was a vault key being kept on the station. If we can find whatever's in that vault before TDR does, we can change our lives! We're bad at this. Like, really bad! TDR has many guns. Talking guns. Guns with legs! I'm gonna blast you so freaking fast! Yeah! Shut up, Richard! <laughs> I always wanted to change the universe for the better, and now we actually can! But more importantly, we'll be drowning in... Are you people like this? <laughs> if you happen to see any corpses along the way, uh, don't worry about them. They're just, uh, yeah, don't worry about them. Toxic personality.
Yoshi on the inside is the rest of them. Let me out of Bounty Hunter! Wow, we were having our first real boss fight together! I'm the strongest out of all the Torg clones! I'm impressed you made it this far. My end soldiers are extremely strong. Honestly, I don't think they were. We're new at this and it was pretty easy to kill them all. If I'm going out, I'm taking you with me! Sh just stay alive. I think she's basically done for. It was a simple perimeter scan, escorting resources. But we were ambushed by Kalan raiders. The fighters were no problem, but the missile frigates were a different story. The command got clever. One wing used cover to keep themselves safe on approach. found a tunnel in the structure to sneak behind them. We're on the run, talk with the range. Take you up. Let's do this. It worked. But just before a carrier battle group arrived, we scrambled bombers. Vector confirmed. Scanning zone adjusted. Perfect for attacking capital ships. This is bomber lead. Engaging carrier. We protected the resources while they hauled in the goods which meant we could roll out assault frigates. Cleared hot. Let's take it to them. Stay on them. Break contact. The Raiders weren't pushovers, but command countered their hit-and-run tactics. The way their carrier exploded? Beautiful. And we even grabbed a little souvenir. That missile frigate is ours now. Can you hear me? shines brightest in the darkest of times. All right, buddy, I'm here for you. Don't worry.
box, liar. <laughs> In the crux of reality, there exists two lies. One before the shadow, and one behind the eye. Thank <laughs> you. 